Oh. Yeah, this is a chute where the seeds go down, and there's a hammer mill that pushes it through a screen. So you don't want to put too big a seed in here. There's that blue flag. Those seeds are pretty good size. It might grind them up rather than shuck them out a oh. lot. And what we got to... Uh, <laughs> Flower. This is what are these flower seeds? Um, this is cone flower. That's uh, no, this one is the black eyed Susans. Yeah, this one I can't remember. They might be more black eyed Susans. Oh, no, this is bee bomb. That's black eyed Susans. Okay, okay. that sounds like some of those we were harvesting in the, the name marsh. Yeah. But a yeah. lot of seeds are really fine. Uh, one of the seeds we harvested was this stone stone crop. But if you can see the oh, the bottom of that done, bag they're fine, this, yeah. They're like dust, Ooh. you know. So we don't know how all this will work with that. Anyway, let's fire it up. Yeah, the idea is that the seeds are so fine that I can't unlike a combine where you blow the air through the you know, and, you, and the heavy grain sifts to the bottom. But I think this has to be a closed system, so I put a vacuum on the other end. There's a fan here that's blowing it. Jeez. And then this guy is just supposed to sort it out a little bit. So. And uh, I will plug it in. Do you need air plugs? It's going to be super loud. <laughs> it shouldn't be too bad. Just turn your hearing aids down. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a long ways from where you started putting that. Yeah, a rusty old hammer mill that I had to build the hood. Yeah, it was just all fun. So I'll turn on the vacuum. So it will be a little loud. To go in the first hopper. For okay. The, most part. the secondary one is just. Four. Well, my theory was it's sort of like my um, sod dust collector. You know, the heavy stuff falls out in the first one, light stuff floating around gets sucked into the second one. So you're, you're hoping for your. I thought there'd be extra little fine seeds stuff over there. Over there. <laughs> Smells good. I can smell that. Oh, you gotta go forward a little with you. Sorry. Oh, oh, look at that. I make herbs. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> smells like herbs. I see lots of seeds there. You gonna broadcast this for your new yard? <laughs>
Oh, different size seat. That, that's his hope. <laughs> so, there you went from course. Those were kind of prickly, some yeah, of those things. Yeah, so this saves is, your yeah. fingers. This this is just if you can see the grates. Well, different sizes. Different size, big size top, smaller as we go down. The idea is they'll shake out into these old um, gutters, you know, yeah. plastic gutter stuff. That's the theory. That's the theory. Just and pour it in the top. You're sticking to it. And yeah, that's right. <laughs> and now, and this I, is. Uh, off the old threshing machine, which probably yeah. dates during the 30s. Yeah. But the fan on just had this neat little uh, crankshaft. It only had about a half inch offset, which I figured is just about the right amount. So I had put in new wood. And you built that arm, it looks like wood, but there isn't. Okay, so we will try. It's not going Okay, go ahead. was off a uh, new idea corn picker mm -hmm. and it tore all apart and it was the basic frame for that. And I was going to break it all down I said, oh what the heck, I know, I know a good use for that. And this is a motor off a of just a shop air compressor and then the, this part's off a of approximately 1930 case threshing machine. And, uh, Cool. So I don't Let's know how much separation you need to do, but some of it's more chaffy than it, but that would go through one of those cedars. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This stuff looks beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I'm just curious. I wonder uh, here. Now, would you, was this old, old equipment? Yeah. Uh, yeah. When you were first on the farm, oh, did you use it? Your sure. five dollars were under your head. I know. <laughs> I better be sweeping this up. Right? 